Kalam Bulan. It is the birth anniversary of Maulana Abul Kalam Azad. It is celebrated over India after the announcement made by the Ministry of Human Resource Development in 2008. National Education Day is a significant day which shows the importance and usefulness of education against society. On this day, special programs are organized in schools. On this day, many educational reforms and development activities are announced by the central and state government. Various education activities such as organizing essays, quizzes, speeches, etc. are to mark the day. This day is also celebrated to raise awareness about the unprivileged children who do not access to have good education or live in areas where there is no good school. This day is celebrated to commemorate the birthday of Abul Kalam Azad by recalling his contribution to the cause of Indian education. Today, 11th November 2020, our school Kendri Vithyalaya SAP Perurkada is celebrating National Education Day commemorating the birth anniversary of Maulana Abdul Kalam Asa. National Education Day, 11th November 2020. Today is a 132nd birth anniversary of Maulana Abdul Kalam Asa. Maulana Abul Kalam Azad was a great freedom fighter, eminent educationist and the first education minister of India. One of his famous quote is, education is basic to the creation of an atmosphere in which human beings can meet one another on a plane of friendship and equality. National Education Day is celebrated across the country every year on November 11. To commemorate the birth anniversary of India's first education minister, Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad. Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad served the country from 1947 to 1958 as the first minister of education in Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru's cabinet. A reformer and a freedom fighter, Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad was not merely a scholar but committed to building of the nation through education. Maulana Abul Kalam Azad was born on November 11, 1888. On this day, various programs and campaigns are organized to spread awareness about education and make every person literate. Ministry of Human Resource Development MHRT, had decided on September 11, 2008 to celebrate November 11 as National Education Day every year. A poet, a scholar, a journalist and a freedom fighter, he contributed to the formation of India along with many leaders. But his biggest contribution to India has been the gift of education. He was invited in 1920 and elected as the member of the Foundation Committee of Jamia Milia Islamia at Ali Ghar in Uttar Pradesh. In 1934, he assisted in the shifting of the campus of Jamia Milia Islamia to New Delhi. As the first education minister of a free India, responsible for setting up of the Central Institute of Education in Delhi, this later came to be known as the Department of Education under the University of Delhi. He was also responsible for setting up of University Grants Commission in 1953 and emphasized the setting up of Indian Institute of Science or IISC Bangalore. 
but by far his largest contribution to the country were the Indian Institutes of Technology. It was under his leadership that the first IIT, IIT Kharagpur, was set up in 1951. He truly believed in the potential of IITs and had noted, I have no doubt that the establishment of this institute will form a landmark in the progress of higher technological education and research in the country. National Education Day 2020 theme Learning for People, Planet, Prosperity and Peace the 2020 theme highlights the integrated nature of education, its humanistic aims as well as its centrality to our collective development ambitions. Finally, I would like to conclude by mentioning a small quote by Nelson Mandela. Education is the most powerful weapon we can use to change the world. I hope all of you enjoyed this presentation and got more information about National Education Day as well as our first education minister Maulana Abdul Kalam Asad. Thanks for watching.